friends and subscribers, we're headed into Spring Festival Chinese New Year 2013 and this is another Street Eats. I am today on the outskirts of Shanghai in Chiba. And Chiba has some delicious and unique uh, Chinese street food that uh, I'll give you a close look at. Marco Polo wrote many times about the canals of this area of China. Here's uh, one of them, old bridge through Chibao. It's got uh, three distinct uh, entrances of the canals and it goes all the way throughout uh, Shanghai and many of the cities throughout this delta. So many cafes and restaurants are placed along these canals all throughout this area of China. And it's really a treat to go and uh, sample the cuisine and take a look at how China was many, many years ago. Okay, let's start it off here with candied hawthorn berries. And hawthorns uh, have a lot of good health properties and are actually delicious to cook with, but these are candied, so they've got a glaze on them. And that's how they look. Quite delicious. 500 grams, only 9.8 RMB. First you cut the bamboo and then you put the meat or rice in the bamboo and then you roast it and that's the snack. Sticky rice bamboo. Handmade dumplings, wontons. Made fresh, go right in the pot and into your stomach. Good stuff. This, this is unique that I've been trying to show you guys for a while. It's called Beggar's Chicken. It's basically a whole chicken that is almost petrified and it's wrapped inside of newspaper. Um, I first saw this in Nanjing, but uh, here it is, uh, whole chicken, right there. I know it looks a little strange, but uh, that's uh, how they do it. Beggar's chicken. This is uh, burnt eggs. These are uh, quail eggs or duck eggs, and it's cooked in this pot, and then you can get a uh, pack of them to take home. Peel them and eat them. Antran. Quail. Whole barbecue quails by the bundle. They're stabbed right through the head and down to the body. And they're dipped into the sauce. And then you take a whole stack of quail with you. So quail, quail egg over there. Uh, here's some neck or intestine. There's some more little critters. <laughs> and then uh, stuffed uh, snails. Stuffed snail shells. Really unique stuff here at Chibao. Oh, Kevin. That's fresh pig feet by the dozen. And this looks like it might be got ham hocks, I don't know what, but it's a lot. And this is, one's barbecued and one is not, but that's incredibly gluttonous. Meat on a stick. All kinds of meat. Mountains of meat on a stick. Wow. Followed by stinky tofu. 
，好吃的不得了，来一份。<笑>这个 pancake 的，叫什么 ？As anybody that's lived in China knows, there's nothing more hideous a smell than stinky tofu, and this stuff stinks mightily. Put it in a cup. Put a couple of different sauces on it on a stick. Start, yeah. Ah, Wu Kwai, five RMB. These critters here were placed in the fryer hole. That's whole crabs and whole prawns just placed in the fryer. And that's even right there. It looks like a huge prawn, the size of a baby lobster. A smorgasbord of spiced uh, nuts and uh, looks like a sauerkraut or soured pickled peanuts, um, kimchi, you name it. If you like corned beef, then this might be for you. This is a lamb and they uh, dry it out a little bit and they slice it in chunks just like this and each one of those chunks uh, you take home salted and it's really good uh, something I would actually eat is uh, lamb kind of like a precursor to hardtack or a corned beef sandwich well slice this up put it between uh, two pieces of rye bread and you got yourself a good sandwich this is sticky rice and corn husks. This is quite popular. Could be filled with uh, anything. Could be filled with pig or beef or anything like that. Really fills you up. It's quite heavy, cheap. Actually, taste the pink They're saying uh, "ip iko we pi." Okay, where's the boatman to take me across? Because I don't know. Ah, the bridge. The bridge will do. The famous dumpling restaurant. And it's got really good crab dumplings as well as the traditional pork dumplings. You can get a stack uh dumplings and uh eat it up. There's a menu for the uh famous dumplings chibao. Still pretty cheap, nothing over about uh eighty-eight UN for shark fins crab soup. Pack. This right here can best be described as a dragon's beard. It's really thin uh, strands of rice or other type of grain with uh, nut and sesame and spices on the inside of it. They roll it up like this, sell it in packs, and when it's fresh, it's quite good and inexpensive. It's only 15. Coconut juice and these candied fruits. They're basically on a stick. Really popular. Hawthorn, strawberry, uh, pineapple, kiwi. Put inside of a candy like uh, mixture and it comes out like this.